All right, welcome, welcome, welcome to another edition of Midday Motivation. Great afternoon, everyone. So today is gonna kind of tie into yesterday's message. Yesterday's message was who are you? Basically defining who you are and you're you know, looking into your name and what name you were given. So today, I'm going to kick off a new thing with Midday Motivation. The first of every month, we are going to, oh, consider this. We are going to um, go over a book. The first of every month, I'm going to introduce you to a book that I've read. And since it's this, since this is my first time um, reviewing a book for you, I'm going to review the first book that I read this year for 2016. It's an amazing book. I love it. I have actually have read it. Well, I didn't read it. I have it on Audible. So if you are one of those people that don't really like to read or you don't have time. Hey, D. Um, you don't have time to read. Actually sit down and read. You can download Audible. Um, there's a free trial, maybe a 30-day trial or something like that. And when you get a free trial, you get a free book with your free with your free trial. So, um, hey, Aunt Tina, this book I suggest be your first book that you get with your free trial. It's a pretty short read, only about 18 or 19 chapters. Um, if you get it on Audible, or if you read it, you know, if you buy the book. So I have it on Audible, so I can't show you what the book looks like. Um, before I get into the book, you know I'm silly, so I have my intro. Can you hear it? I can go twice as high. Okay. That's the reading rainbow music. A reading rainbow. I can go anywhere. Okay, let me stop. But anyway. I was having way too much fun with that blast from the past. If you were born, if you're an 80s baby or if you raised kids during the 80s, you know all about reading Rainbow. But anyway, our book, the book that I've been talking about for the month of June is The Power of I Am by Joel Osteen. It is an amazing book. It is definitely life changing. It will help you not only understand the power of defining who you are and just your statements but it, it will definitely help you understand that help you understand the importance of paying attention to what you say and um how you define yourself when you say i am you, a lot of times you can even just be joking and say you know I'm so dumb. I turned down the wrong street. Do you even realize you just said, I'm so dumb? No, you're not dumb. Like, that's something I used to say all the time. I was good for pulling a, oh, I'm so dumb. I'm so crazy. But, you know, don't do that. Why does that? I'm sorry. My hair distracts me. So, I want you to, of course, read the book or get it on Audible. Um... It has inspired a lot of things that I've done this year. Just take the time to listen to it or read it. Some of the things in that book are um, very, like he, take, he takes kind of complex things and makes them very simple. So, for example, and some things you just wouldn't believe, but it's so true. The statements that you make and the words that you say, hey, Marcus, the words that come out of your mouth manifest things in your life. So for you to say, you know, I am incredible. I am great. You, These are things, you know, even if you don't feel incredible that day when you first get up, maybe by the end of the day after you tell yourself that you're incredible for a while, you'll start feeling incredible. You'll start doing incredible things, you know. So... Just you, it teaches you to use the power of your tongue, use the power of I am and understand and believe that the things that you say will be. Um, 
Speaking of, am is a form of the word be. Be is a defining term. It is what you will become. So you, when you say what you, I am, you know, you're saying what you be, okay? What you are. So enough for the English lesson. I do want to um, give you a couple examples out of the book. Um, one story is, man, it's a great story. He tells about this lady that wants to stop smoking. So you have to understand that you can, everything that we do, we are conditioned to do. We taught ourselves to do it or someone else taught us to do it. We believe certain things to make us do whatever it is we do. Whatever habits we have, we've been conditioned to do those things. So if you're smoking, hey, Taya, if you're smoking and you want to stop smoking, you just need to recondition your mind to not smoke. You have, you've conditioned your mind and your body to need the nicotine, to want to smoke. Now you just have to condition your mind, which controls your body, that you don't want to smoke. You have to believe that you don't want to smoke. So the lady in the story, she um, wants to stop smoking. So she's told, you know, well, you need to claim that you are not a smoker. So you're walking around, I am a smoker. You should change that. I am a non-smoker. I am not a smoker. So she decided that every time she smoked a cigarette, she would just tell her, remind herself, I'm not a smoker. I don't even like the taste of cigarettes. I'm not a smoker. Smoking makes me sick. And over time, she reconditioned herself to not smoke to not want to smoke and there just came a day where she started to smoke a cigarette and she got sick she did not like the taste of the cigarette so much that she felt sick to her stomach and from that day on she did not smoke again she reconditioned her mind to control her body to not want cigarettes she defined herself as a non-smoker. I am a non-smoker. So, that's my book for this month. I hope you all go out and get it. I don't get any commissions off of it, but it will do great things for your life. It's done great things for mine. So, um, that's our book. It's again called The Power of I Am by Joel Osteen. You can go pick it up from any bookstore or download it on Audible or you can get it off Amazon. It's a great read. So that's our midday motivation for today. Go out and pick up the book. So the first of the month we'll review. Um, I'll go over a book review with you. Um, today's was I Am. Well, The Power of I Am by Joel Osteen. I think it's probably a gray book with his picture on the front. Have an amazing day on purpose. Hopefully, even the stories I told you from the book was inspiring today. Um, hit me in the comments. Let me know if you're cool with a book review once a month um, as part of our midday motivation. So thank you for your time. Enjoy your day. Have an amazing day on purpose. I'll see you tomorrow for our regular midday motivation in the 12 o'clock hour. Thank you.